Hi everyone, happy Friday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Yes, with another eight box jumbo break of the brand new 2019 Bowman Draft Baseball. This is pick your team number seven, jumbo seven. And if you see a little rooftop next to your name, that means you won those uh, teams in the team random, which is in a separate video. Thanks everybody for getting in. Really appreciate it. I feel like something's wrong with that list. Didn't that person not take that team anymore? Maybe that didn't change. What, what was it on the team, Random? Hang on a second, folks. I'm going to pause the video really quick, and when we come back, we're going to figure this out. Stand by. Welcome back, folks. All right, I, I knew something. There was there was an issue. Oh, this is the, I was using the other printer. Hang on, I'll be right back. All right, welcome back, folks. Take three. There you go. There's the. I just, I just used the printer in the other, the other studio. All right, so pick your team seven, eight box jumbo. I realized that the person who had the Padres divested himself of the Padres, and then. Patrick actually won that in the team random. Gotta fill that in too. All right, so big thanks to everybody who got into the action. Really appreciate it. Let's pop open this jumbo case. And there will be an autograph recap at the end, so if you don't want to... I guess if you don't want to watch this, if you're watching the replay, you're like, Joe, I'm not going to watch an hour-long video. I don't got time for that. You're right. Just fast forward right to the end. All right. Three autographs per box. On average. Good luck, everyone. Appreciate everybody getting in. Um, a couple of people were asking earlier, any Super Factor? We have not pulled a Super Factor yet out of this. We've done thousands, literally gone through thousands of cards. Between Jumbo 1 through 6, and a handful of a uh, handful of super jumbos, no super fracture of any kind. Not even a, we've pulled a couple printing plates, but no super fracture. Not even a non-auto super fracture, let alone an autograph super fracture. So obviously pretty rare, but I feel like we're due. All right, and for those of you watching live, I am going to drop the uh, the latest MLB.com draft tracker so you can see uh, the draft class. And if you click on their names, it'll expand the names and kind of get a, a brief idea of what these players are all about. I know these are all pretty much brand new players, which makes it very exciting. A lot of prospect hunting here. Obviously, paper doesn't ship, so we won't be shipping those, but all this chrome will ship. Obviously, numbered paper cards will ship. So that's why I'm flying through the paper, just in the interest of time. We'll slow down. These are facsimile autographs, but we'll slow down for the chrome. I like the jumbos. There's a good rhythm to, to all of it. The hobbies were brutal. They don't make the hobbies anymore, thankfully. <laughs> thankfully. And our first autograph is Blake Walston, Diamondbacks. That'll go to EA and the Snakes. Mm. 
There you go. First rounder, late first round pick. And another Diamondback for Eric. 204 out of 499. That is Tommy Henry. Nice. A uh, second round pick. We got Alejandro Kirk to green chrome to 99. Those will save off to the side and we'll, our shipping team will sleeve and top load those before they get sorted out. Anything numbered like five or less, I'll definitely top load right away. So they'll be protected, they'll be fine. Purple Chrome, we've got, we got uh, Christian Javier, 56 out of 250. That'll go to Glenn who got randomized the Astros in the team random. And we have Tim Tebow, blue paper to 150. Does Tebow make it to the majors, ladies and gentlemen? Anyone think Tebow will actually make it to the majors? Will he actually start a game? No, right? Maybe, cup of coffee perhaps? Just to say he did it, just to so the organization said he did it. And then they, then they DFA him afterwards. We got Ryan Garcia, paper to four ninety nine. Where's our third autograph? Maybe at the very, 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 very end. Third auto. I guess it is on average. Come on, third auto then. Third auto should be right here. It's Kendall Jenner Williams. That'll go to Jason Jones, who got the Blue Jays in a team random. There you go, second round pick. So two Diamondbacks, two snakes, and a bird. Box one. All right, next box. Any exciting baseball news happening? I guess, I guess it's I guess the stove has been a little hotter than it has been in the last couple of years, where free agency and all that signing has been a little. Slow. And what do I got here for headlines? Oh, yeah. Last night, the Rays Padres announced the Tommy Fan Hunter Renfro trade, which was interesting. Is I was hearing on MLB Network that, that long story short, that Renfro may put up similar numbers as Tommy Fan, but just it's cheaper. <laughs> so that, that's, that's a good payroll move. But like a, I think a big prospect got moved on the Padres side of things. Fam solid though. I like Tommy Fam. Mets re-signed Brad Brack. Rangers signed Kyle Gibson. Nationals re-signed Howie Kendrick to a year deal. Twins signed Alex Avila. Yankees reportedly prioritizing Garrett Cole. Twins are going to re-sign Michael Pineda. The SK Wyverns, I think it's a South Korean team, uh, post lefty Kwon Hyung Kim. Kim Hwang Hyun. Reds sign Mike Moustakis. Brewers acquire Omar uh, Narvez. 
Mets acquiring Jake Mariznick. Stephen Cohen in talk to increase investment in the Mets. Angels picked up Dylan Bundy. Phillies to sign Zach Wheeler. And Braves signed Cole Hamels. So that's what's happening so far. Early on. Cubs signed Dan Winkler. I don't know who he is. White Sox claimed Tyron Guerrero. Yankees and Brett Gardner still negotiating a contract. Diamondbacks expected to spread free, free agent spending. Spread free agent spending? What does that mean? Just increase the payroll? Maybe or spread it around? I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, it looks like there's, they're going to spread it around. That's, that's the idea. All right. Well, let's see what happens. There's Freudus Nova to 250 for the Strohs, purple chrome. And I like these black parallels. I think these look sharp. 48 out of 75, Logan Driscoll for the Padres. That'll be for Patrick and the Friars. All right, so that's our first autograph out of the box. Brandon Malone, Brent Brewer sign, dot, dot, dot. What are the, what are the Brewers need to do? we need, we got to get some starting pitching for the Brewer crew, right? That's got to be something. I'm going to go to their the Brewer's depth chart here. Let's see what it's looking like so far. I like the new unis for the Brewers. But NL Central could be got, you know, without without breaking the bank, I think. I mean, they got they got Urias there, which is I think a nice pickup. I think Padres maybe gave up on Luis Urias a little too early. Keston here is going to be a stud. I guess Luis Urias third base. I see I, at least according to MLB.com's death chart. Braun at first. I'll try to get to a couple. No worries. Uh, purple paper out of two fifty. Vince Fernandez and another raw for the Rockies. Purple Mountains Majesty Josh. And Connor Capel to 250, purple paper for the Cardinals, Aaron Pettit. Yelich, when's Yelich coming back? Is he going to be fine by spring training? It was kind of a weird injury, kneecap thing. Lorenzo Kane is still out there. You saw the thing with him and you, Darvish. I did see Got that. A little Twitter spat. I feel like I feel like Yelich didn't have to respond, but he kind of got triggered. I know, but he kind of dunked on Darvish. I mean, yeah, absolutely, which <laughs> yeah, is, is kind of hilarious. Figured, but, yeah. like, why would you even respond to someone that you don't respect as a pitcher? Yeah. You know? What was he like? Yeah, I don't even, He's like, well, I don't we, need, I don't need a cheat to hit you. off you. Or something. Yeah. It's and like 62 Josh, out of 150. And then Josh Donaldson responded to that. He was like, well, I need to. I guess, <laughs> I guess his numbers against Darvish are really bad. Josh Mears, Padres. Patrick with that one. I mean, I think we've seen that it's pitching that definitely wins the World Series, is, is right? So Brewers aren't going to get it done. I like the Brewers' offense. Brewers aren't going to get it done with Brandon Woodruff, Andrew Hauser, Eric Lauer, Bruce Suter. What happened to Jimmy Nelson? Yeah, what happened to Jimmy Nelson? Is he done? I kind of like Jimmy Nelson. I like Jimmy Nelson. I like Corbin Burns too, but I mean I don't know if he's a, like a true number one or anything like. He's a solid pitcher. They got Peralta down there too. I thought they would go for Trevor Bauer. Like Trevor Bauer would be someone they could put in that. What in the trade? Yeah, like over the summer when Trevor Bauer got traded to the Reds. Yeah. The Reds. I, that was weird. Yeah, yeah I didn't. It seemed like a 
move that the I thought that's a move that the Brewers would make. Add Trevor Brow Bauer, and then you try to chase another player in free agency. And then you've got a decent one-two punch right there. Speaking of the Brew Crew, there's Antoine Kelly. 29 out of 50. Gold. Shimmer. Maybe he's the arm they're looking for. Could be. It looks like, like according to MLB.com, all their prospects are outfielders, infielders. Marcos Ditlan is, I think, the Adrian Hauser. That's what his name is. I don't know. We'll see. All right, there's Antoine Kelly for the Brew Crew. Gold Shimmer to 50. And once again, that'll be for John Alfies and the Brewers. That's the third autograph of the box. There's Grant McRae to four ninety nine paper. And that's another box right there. And once again, there will be an autograph recap at the end. Obi-Wan, what's going on? Bucks are destroying the Clippers right now. 91 to 60 something, 93 to 65. It's Giannis's birthday, I guess. There's Ryan Garcia, purple chrome, 119 at 250 for the Rangers. Josh Proust. There you go, guys. A little off center there. There you go. Nice on the board. There's Bryant Packard, 20 out of 50 gold chrome. It's all that paper there, which we end up donating. There's Will Robertson. 14 out of 150 for Jason Jones and the Blue Jays. Blue Chrome. Two hundred one out of four ninety nine. Sean Jelly. That's that's how you say his name. I think we learned. There you go. I think it's pronounced Jelly. I guess his nickname Jelly. That goes to uh, Darren McKenzie and the Giants.
We've got Jake Sanford for the Yankees. Robert Throne with the Bronx Bombers. Second of the three autographs in the box. Out of four ninety nine, Jordan Groshans. One more autograph here. There's 15 out of 99. Hayden Wisniewski, green paper for the Yankees. Another one for Robert. And the last autograph of the box is Cameron Cannon. I wonder if he has a good arm. Jonathan Kent with the Boston Red Sox. There you go. And the rest is just paper. All right. Next box right over here. Jared Triolo, Speckle. And we got Christian Cairo to 250 purple paper. Oklahoma City Thunder just tied it. Zero is on the clock. And we got Brandon Williamson. Refractor autograph to four ninety nine for the M's. That's going to go to Tyler. Tyler Stumpf got randomized the Mariners in the team random. Nice second round pick. And a class of 2019 autograph, Zach Thompson. 249 out of 250 on that Zach. Is he a first? He is. He's, he was your 19th overall pick out of Kentucky. Left-handed pitcher. And that'll go to Aaron Pettit and the Redbirds. He got randomized the Cardinals in that team, Randon. There's Michael Massey to four ninety nine for the Royals paper.
be one more autograph in here somewhere. There's Tyler Bomb to 250. And there's our third auto. It's Keone Cavaco. Minnesota Twins. That's going to go to Daryl with the Twinkies. Thirteenth overall pick. Nice. And the rest paper. All right. We're about halfway through this break, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck, everybody. Halfway there. And we've got Obsidian coming up after this, then Rookies and Stars after that, and that should bring us right to the end of the night. Everything else that fills will go off tomorrow. Join us tomorrow. National Hobby Shop Day, folks, on Saturday. If you're in the area, visit us, PCH, 14th and Pier in Hermosa Beach, California, right on PCH, next to the van store. This will have prizes and pizza and raffles and sales and discounts. And if you're in the area, come by, hang out, come say hi. Open from 11 to 8. And we group break online from 2 to 10. West Coast time. And we've got a Dodger autograph, Cody Hosey. First round pick for the Dodgers. That goes to Ken McLeod. Nice one, Ken. Third base prospect. I think he came out of college. Yeah, out of Tulane. Hoping that he can become possibly future Justin Turner. That's the idea anyway. Short of their own. Out of, out of what? Penny Retail. Oh. Prison. I gotta, you know, send There's Dios Bell Arias to four ninety nine. I gotta get Passel. Get an extra Passel. auto back, yeah. There's two cards with three there's two packs with only three cards. What? And they're supposed to have four cards per pack. Out of what basketball? Yeah, prison those purple boxes we've been doing. Mm. Yeah. Sixty seven out of two fifty, Tony Losi. Purple paper for the Cardinals. Darren, no, not Darren McKenzie. That goes to Aaron Pettit. There he is again. Superfractor yet? No Superfractor yet. There's Jordan Groshans, 47 out of 99. That's for the Blue Jays, by the way. That go to Jason Jones, who got randomized the Blue Jays in the team random. Some gold paper. Josh Mears for the Padres. 30 out of 50 for Patrick. 
I'm the and king of the super Tyler Bowman. Callahan. That's true. Remember that Carlos Rodon super And the Chris cool? Bryant. That's right, the Chris Bryant too. And I hit uh, Rowdy Tellez, I think too. All right, and Tyler Callahan. There's number at 313 out of 499. Going to Daryl and the Red Legs. Yeah, that Rodon at one point was really good. He got, I think he's injured. decent, but he got injured, yeah. yeah. I think both him and like Carson Fulmer. Yeah. Both of those guys get healthy. That could be and, a really uh, interesting Giolito. team. Giolito, healthy. Really good, yeah. Was, was, had an incredible season this year. And if that Giolito was still on the Nationals, I can know. you imagine? That would be crazy. Although they got, uh, they got Adam Eaton. Adam Eaton. He was good in the first season. He was. He was. He, he was just. Remember, he got injured like his first season. Yeah. I always like him. Yeah. I, I thought he was a solid player. Yeah. There's Kyle McCann, two fifty. Arizona had him. Arizona had a nasty team if they kept their core. <laughs> remember. Didi Gregorius, Adam Eaton, Goldschmidt. You know. Well, all those um, other guys. Yeah, that one stat where it was like every yeah, player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically, yeah. every player in the World Series played on the uh, Diamondbacks. Max Scherzer. Although he was back for like a second. Yeah, he was on a different era, but. But Corbin. Yeah, they also had that Archie Bradley. I don't know if he ever panned out though. Wasn't Archie Bradley close for them? Oh, he does. He's, he he's was so. really top prospect. Prospecting is hard. Yeah. It is. This stuff is perfect for prospecting, ladies and yeah. gentlemen. More, fun, more in the store. Yeah, that's why everyone loves this. Yeah. That's, that's why we bother doing this. Yeah. <laughs> if the value for these wasn't so huge. I mean, they'll never have a higher price card, you know? These guys. Right. This, this, these are their yeah. literally their firsts. Ever since Mike Trout exploded him in 2009, it, uh, his, his first card... And everyone's, everyone's like, everyone's changed. all about Bowman draft after that. Yeah. There's Josh, hungry like the wolf for the Mets. That's going to go to Armando and his Mets. Second round pick. more boxes go so this stack is a box that stacks a box and that stack right there will be the final box right here good luck everybody thank you Nick this paper oh. card doesn't want to stay on top Cal Mitchell doesn't want to stay on top sorry Cal Mitchell he's gonna get removed sorry there's the Cal Mitchell it doesn't ship anyway but there it is it's paper Blaze Alexander Speckle, one of last year's draft picks. We got Jared Triolo for the Pirates to 150. Matt Sims, blue paper. Andrew Vaughn, there he is. Francesco, where are you? White Sox, our, this, I think this is our first Andrew Vaughn. Blue Wave, 
102 out of 150. I feel like he's a decent autograph. He just needs to make it a little bit larger. I just want to stretch that auto out. Andrew Vaughn, of course, is your third overall pick out of California, out of Berkeley. Cal. Cal Bear. There he is. Nice. Nice one for the White Sox. That is strong. I like it. You want to snap a picture of that Andrew Vaughn if you have a second? Whoa, Andrew Vaughn. Yeah, you didn't see that? Blue Wave, Andrew the Vaughn. Cal Golden Bear? Cal Golden Bear. California. And there's Gunnar Henderson. 68 out of 71. Speckle for Ken and the O's. Right. Uh, and Andrew Vaughn related to uh, Rick Vaughn. We wear caps and sleeves at this level, son. Heater's a problem. Is it cold out there? No, we're getting two more, you know, space heaters. But. Oh. It's actually kind of perfect in here. There's Logan Wyatt Earp. But, it, yeah, it's cold out there. That goes to Darren McKenzie and the Giants. I think the white ones, it won't show all these. I don't think know? it will either. So it'll be good. And we got our palm tree logo on it. Oh, nice. Yeah, let's, let's stop promoting everybody else. Get our palm tree logo on there. And our website, of course. I mean, when are we going to get tats of that palm tree logo? I think we're getting hoodies and shirts soon. Hoodies? Yeah. Do love hoodies. Did, love you, hoodies. did you see how I left the magazine open to the Adidas hat page? Yeah, yeah, I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> that was intentional. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> That was intense. I, was like, I, was like, I wonder who was looking in here. Yeah, maybe leave it on, leave it open on the Adidas hat page. Maybe we can get some Jaspies Adidas I think we'll hats. Be sponsored by Nike. What? I'm sponsored by it. Adidas. Really? Yeah. You have separate gear. I'll have separate gear. It would be like an, it'll be uh, like the golfers who have all different ones. Yep. And like Titleist and like you know all this. Yeah, I think I think we're a Nike family. Wow. Nike and Pepsi. What about Champion? Isn't don't the kids oh, yeah, love, Champion? Isn't is really Champion making popular. a comeback? Yeah, for the kids cheap, and they're cheap, so I could probably convince us to be a uh, Champion family. Out of four ninety nine, Tyler, the kids will love the Champion. Yeah, if they can get a ja if oh, they can get, get that sick, sick Jaspies logo, Champion logo on the side. No, what we need is Jaspies starter jackets. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Now you're talking. I think people who don't even know. Wait, hold on. Those. Big like '90s puff, puffy jackets yeah, yeah. from back in the yeah. day. Oh, okay. Those are big now. I know. I wish I had kept some of those. Yeah, but if we get some champion starter jackets with. Look at this supreme champion jacket. Is there are your three autographs right there. On stock X. The they used that to sell trading cards. They used to not, uh, the big starter jackets, they used to not let kids wear that to school, to element because of like gang affiliations like out here in L.A. Oh. They wouldn't let people wear like Raider starter jackets or Steeler starter jackets out here because gangs would wear them in, in L.A. I think that you weren't allowed to wear Marlins logos in his school. Oh, really? Marlins was a thing at his school. Out of 150, Joseph Ortiz. I didn't have that problem. No, no gangs York, in new no. gangs in like Westchester Carrollton, County, Texas, no. and Westchester, New York. No. Who bought out Champion? Steve Olson. Yusai Kikuchi. That's what Steve Olson's saying. Maybe there's an autocorrect situation there. Uh, we got some Tebow. 63 out of 99. Green paper for the Mets. Armando with that one. T Bones. We got Josh Wolf. For Armando, 90 out of 150. I know, Armando, there there were some other guys chasing another player on the Mets. We haven't seen that guy yet. I think we've only seen one. Uh, 
Wait, that must have auto-corrected from Gucci. Now that I look at it, right? Oh, Gucci. Did Gucci buy out Champion? Well, I don't want to say the word, that word, because that's... Well, like yeah. A... I mean, that's what Brian O's trying to bait us into that word. Uh, Isaiah Campbell. Blue Wave autograph for the M's. That goes to Tyler Stumpf. Got randomized. I mean, that means that thing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. something? Yeah. Okay. But I think it's Special spelled, area. I think it's spelled with two O's. Right, 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 right. I don't know if it's in the dictionary. I don't think so. I think that's maybe in the urban dictionary. Do you know what hangry means? That's in the dictionary. Yeah, when you're hungry and angry. Yeah. I thought it was some other H word that some people are sometimes and hungry. Oh, oh, no. Like, you know, teenagers. Right, 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 right. Teenagers are this a lot. I don't know. That'd be, that'd be kind of weird. <laughs> I always thought that, so I heard my. So you were just like. Okay. I Thanksgiving. Like, well, I was wow, like, why would you? A, why would you tell me that? That's a crazy drop at Thanksgiving. It's a right. family show. Right. Oh, Gucci bot champion. That's oh, okay. So is that is that why there's some extra like clout for for champion these days? I know they like clout the a lot. the the fashionistas here in Los Angeles. I see the kids yeah, around we'll, here we'll wearing get, the champion. We'll get champion Jaspies. Right, maybe we'll go get champion stuff now. But I think our shirts would be Hanes because that's you know. Those are comfy. Reliable. I mean, come on. And yeah. we're getting the tagless ones. Yeah, those last forever. And Michael Jordan. They're super comfy. Know. Jordan. Right. Jordan, right. Bugs Bunny. Jordan, Bugs Bunny. There's Jack Little. Lola Bunny. 250. Space Jam. Um, it's good. If it's good enough for Michael Jordan, it's good enough for us, right? Who's the guy in Space Jam? Charles uh, Barkley. Bill Murray. Bill Murray. Groundhog Day. The Monstars. Day, Groundhog Day. Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks Big. You ever play that game? Big? Where you have to name an actor and then name a movie that actor has no. been in, and then name an actor that name. A I don't know. I don't know who else is in Big. Who's that old guy in it? He's also in uh, Elf. He plays the dad in Elf. Oh, angry dad. He's um, in Big, isn't he? Is he in Big? Yeah. I know he's in Elf. He's uh. Why am I? He's in Godfather. I'm blanking on his name. He's in Godfather. Yeah. The elf guy? Yeah, it, yeah. Son, he was he was Sonny Corleone. No. Out of four ninety nine. Pretty sure that's the guy I'm thinking of. You're trolling me. I'm not. Bob Newhart. No, not Bob Newhart. No, not. No, Bob who's Newhart. Elf's, Will Ferrell's James dad? James Con. Yeah, James Con was Sonny Corleone in was Godfather. He in big? I don't know if he was in Big. No, I don't think he was. I mean, Gemini saying Corleone. saying the old guy in Big is a general Independence Day. Who's in Independence Day? Will Smith. Will Smith. Okay. Um, James Paxton? The baseball no. pitcher? No. <laughs> John Paxton? No, that's a basketball Bill player. Paxton Bill Paxton? Bill Paxton. That's, no a, bas- longer, that's a Chicago Bulls him. power forward in no, the No, that's 90s. Bill. No, that. John Paxton. The president in Independence Day, I don't think, is, is with us. Oh, yeah, Bill Paxton. He yeah. was an American actor. That Aww. means he's passed, yeah. He was no longer with us at sad times. He does have a kid named James Paxton. Does he really? Yeah. Is he on the Mariners? Matt Cantorino is your last autograph out of the second to last box. Last box coming up in Pick Your Team 7. No, but he's co-starring in the USA drama series Eyewitness that a lot of people watch. I, USA, today, uh, USA is a big network. You know? <laughs> Massive network. Everyone watches the USA network. During March Madness to watch a 16 play the one. Yeah, that's like no one can ever find True TV. On right, that. True TV. Oh, I can't wait till March Madness rolls around. It's like, where's, where True the hell TV. is True TV on my and TV? It's like that Practical Joker show pops yeah. up, and you're watching like Punk. On, right. You know, like a kid's version. All right, last box, ladies and gentlemen. Pick your team seven. I'm sure we'll do a couple more of these tomorrow. Two Bowman draft baseball breaks a day keeps the doctor away. That is medical fact. If you look up in the New England medical journals, it's all there. It's all there. Brian O'Hu reminiscing about the USA up all night. Hashtag Elvira, the good old days. What? Is that a thing? I'm pretty pretty up on my pop culture, but I do not remember that. I do vaguely remember Crypt Keeper. There's Brandon Malone to four ninety nine. 
how is M. Taylor 20% more accurate than a professional tailor just by taking a picture of me? Does that mean they store pictures of me? I'm not, I, don't, I don't trust that. I don't trust that. Also, I'm worried that they're going to be like, you are fat. I'd be like, come on. Come on, M. Taylor. That's not nice. There's Michael Bush. It's a nice bush for Ken McLeod and the Dodgers. He's a compensatory pick. I think pick 32 or something like that. There you go. 31st overall. Brian O. Oh, he thinks I'm old. Do I look old? Time for time for Botox. Oh, look at this. Brett Beatty. Draft night autograph. Four out of 99. Batty? Beatty? There you go. Armando with the Mets. Armando often buys the Mets from us. Four out of 99. 12th overall pick. There you go, Armando. Nice. Brian, oh, I, I turned 21 in September. No way I'm in my 20s, so you're saying I'm, I look old. Out of 499, Will Wilson, you look like an old man. No way you're in your 20s. Just too fat and flabby. Thanks a lot, Brian, oh. Time to wallow in Jameson later tonight and cry into my pillow. <laughs> paper, 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 paper. Who knows how old I am anymore, Brian? That's a mystery. There's Riley Green to 150. Tigers, Atomic for Rick K. There you go, Rick, something. Wait, wasn't there a Riley Green earlier? I'm just blending cases together now. No, I, don't, I just don't remember anymore. One more autograph to go. There's Tyler Freeman, Green Paper to 99. Brandon Cooks to 99. Brandon Cooks to 99. Brandon Cooks to 99. And the third autograph is Logan Wyatt. Logan Wyatt Earp for the San Francisco Giants. DMAC, Darren McKenzie with that one. Your third autograph. No box topper in this one. Let's see if we get any more color. No super fractor in this one either. The super fractor hunt continues. We may do, I don't know, we may have a couple more of these done tomorrow. Maybe we'll find the super fractor then. Cameron Cannon to 250. Maybe I was, Brian. Maybe I was. Fine, Brian. I'm 31. Not 21. No, I'm 51. There's Logan Wyatt. Brett Beatty, nice. Some Dodgers. There you go. And this is your autograph recap. Josh Hungry Like the Wolf. A couple Dodgers in this one. We haven't seen any Dodgers in a minute or two. So some nice stuff out of here. Thanks, everyone, for getting into the act. I like those black parallels. I think look really sharp. Really appreciate everybody getting in. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We will see you next time for the next break. This is Joe. I'm out.